Hello friends, welcome to Mission to Tutorials. In this video, we will create a custom table using dbschema.xml. Now let's get started. Go to your Magento root directory, go to your module, etc folder. So instead of this, you have to create db underscore schema.xml. So using this file, we will create one custom table. Just create this file and open it. Uh, instead of this schema tag, we need to create one table. You have to provide the table name here. So you, you can mention any name as you want. So I'm just giving it Chandra. Okay. So you leave this as it is resource equal to default, engine equal to inodb. And you can put some comment for this table. Okay. So under this table, we need to create some columns. You can create any number of columns here. Right now, I'm just creating two columns. That is ID and username. I have added this ID as a primary key for this table. Using this ID, we can select the records, we can delete the records, and uh, we can update the records. That's why I have added uh, ID as a primary key. You see here, in the last video, we created this upgrade schema.php. So these many lines of code is required to create one table, but using this dbschema.xml, there are few lines are required to create a table. So it is a easy and simple way to create a table in Machinto. Always go with the dbschema.xml file for creating or adding any column to the particular table. Okay. You can add any column to any table. Okay. Using this dbschema.xml. You can create a column for any existing table also. You can add using this dbschema.xml. Let's go to the git bash. Now let's run the setup upgrade. Now let's check this webdev underscore chandra is created in the database or not. Go to PHP my admin. See here the table is created webdev underscore chandra see what are the columns we created id username id and username you put any number of columns here for this table just add one more column this password leave this as this type worker and name equal to password okay nullable false length 100 comment empty you can change this length and comment as you want okay right now i'm just leaving as it is just go to git bash and again run the setup upgrade so using this db schema.xml we can create a, a number of tables and a number of columns for the existing table now let's check that this password column is added for this table or not just refresh this page see here id username and password just created this column right so this way we can create uh, any number of columns using this db schema.xml you can create a number of tables like like this one or uh, you can create a single table using this db schema.xml in the next video we will discuss about the models resource models and collection uh, in magento and how we can connect uh, these tables and get the data okay thanks for watching